Hello, this is Jason DeMars from Present Truth Ministries, and this is our update for the week of August 25th, 2014. We have a little update from Iran. Pastor Benham Irani is in good condition. He's, he's still in Ghazal Hazar prison, uh, and you know, the conditions in the prison are, are not the greatest. Um, food is not the greatest unless you have a little money to be able to go to their grocery store uh, and, and purchase uh, better quality food. Uh, there's a few other Christians there with him in prison. There's Brother Silas Rabani and Brother Matthias Hagnajad. Uh, Matthias is facing uh, charges of war against Allah. So that was that are his charges. That's punishable by uh, death. So pray for him and for his his family, uh, his wife Anna, and his daughter Anahita. Uh, that God would be with them, comfort them, and grant deliverance to them. Um, conditions for Iranian Christians are are not good. Uh, there's many that are fleeing Iran and and going to live in Turkey in order to go through the UN refugee process and go to a, another country. Uh, please remember them in prayer. Uh, pray for Iranian Christians. There's a lot of fear that's going on. There's a lot of worry that's going on. And, and God is working in such a great way there in Iran and moving on people's hearts and lives. And many are coming to faith and so many are, are struggling because they don't have much of a community of believers to gather around because of the fear. It's, it's difficult to gather together. It's difficult to maintain the meetings. Uh, people are worried and scared that the secret police are going to be coming after them. So pray for their faith to be, remain strong. Pray for, for them not to be living in fear, making decisions out of fear, but that would be walking and living uh, in faith. Uh, we will be continuing to work with those refugees. Uh, in Turkey to to spread the message to them to work with the political refugees to to share the Christian faith with them God is moving God is working there uh, thank you for your your support uh, I wouldn't be able to go without your financial support we, we also support the pastors who are living and, and working there on a daily basis with believers there thank you for your support we need your continued support we appreciate you. Uh, continue to pray. Continue to hold these things up before the Lord in prayer. May God bless you. This was our update for the week of August 25th, 2014. I'm Jason DeMars from Present Truth Ministries. God richly bless you.